Well, it was one-stop shopping today for area veterans. The Mississippi State University Center for America's Veterans and other organizations hosted a summit this week, or rather today in Starkville. Our Blair Schaefer was there and joins us in the studio with more on it. Blair. Andrea, representatives were on hand to help vets enroll in VA health care as well as file and check on their own VA claims. The event also featured a health fair with important health screening, and I was able to talk to some veterans who were able to receive the help they needed. Jeff Donald is a retired officer from the Army. Like many veterans, he needs help navigating services and resources available to him after his military career ended. I'd want to talk to TRICARE. We have a TRICARE rep here. VA had some VA issues. I want to talk to VA. And then you got all these organizations that are here, provide service like the VFW and American Legion, and all these the companies that are offering jobs to the veterans. I think that's tremendous to have it in one place. The Center of America's Veterans at MSU saw a need for an event that makes services accessible to vets and their families. We have lots of employers, lots of resources. We really just want to make it real easy for them, one stop shop not have to go online, not have to call somebody on the phone, but they can meet face to face with somebody. And these face to face opportunities could lead these vets to good paying jobs. We have some employers that are actually giving uh, job interviews today, taking resumes today, so they can certainly maybe leave here with a job. Not only is there help for older veterans, but there is also assistance for younger veterans who might want to go to college. There are a whole bunch of scholarship opportunities, uh, help with the families, that most don't really know about. So coming to a place like this, or an event like this, I should say, more of in hearing and be able to join or sign up, it does really help them. Organizers say the feedback they get will help them build on what they've started and improve future events. I mean, obviously, I know a lot of these veterans from the local community, uh, so they've all came up to me and said how much they appreciate having this at this location. Uh, you know, veterans are a very appreciative group anyways, and uh, so the response has been terrific. There were more than 70 booths with resources, services, and job opportunities for vets to explore. Andrea.